as an example of the credible type of sightings reported by reputable, trained observers was the report of Captain Willis Sperry. What is your full name, Captain? Captain Willis Sperry. How long with American Airlines? 17 years. Well, what was the date of sighting? May the 29th, 1950. And the time of sighting? 9.30 in the evening. The origin of sighting? 60 miles southwest of Washington, D.C. And the destination? Nashville, Tennessee. What was the visibility? It was unlimited. And what was your altitude? 7,500 feet. Who of the crew first saw the object? The co-pilot called it to my attention as I had turned to reach for a map. The object was flying head on at us. It was 50 times the magnitude of the brightest star. I immediately made an abrupt turn to avoid collision. As I looked to my left, the object appeared to come to a stop. Can you describe the shape of the object? It appeared as a perfectly streamlined object without wings or tail section, as it was silhouetted against the full moon. At all times, it had a brilliant, shimmering blue light in the nose. It was traveling at fantastic speed, and although it had passed off our left wing tip, it circled us in a matter of seconds and appeared off our right wing. There again, it stopped, and we watched it for several seconds. When again it started, it reversed its direction. We watched it for several more seconds until it disappeared in the east out of sight. Have you ever seen any other similar object, Captain? Never before or since. 